Hi, you are watching the Movavi Beauty Vlog, and today I'll show you how to make yourself smoky eyes, like I did. Can I remove it now? Yeah. Ow! Gosh. So this is how you use sticky notes. Whoa, whoa, don't trust my evil twin. You're watching the Movavi vlog where we show you how to create cool videos. My name is Roman. So what do you think about our short horror movie? This is how we're preparing for the Halloween. Hit the like button if you got scared. By the way, did you know Halloween is included in the list of children's most common phobias? Let us know in the comments how you usually celebrate Halloween and what your favorite costume is. Meanwhile, I explain to you how to make your reflection live its own life. Dude, it's been a while. You gotta find your own place. Me? Are you kicking me out? You never see me again! He'll come back. This effect can be achieved in two different ways, by split-screen method or by chroma keying. Let's start with the first one, it's easier. All you need is a tripod and a camera, or a smartphone. Fix the camera so the main character stands in the one half of the frame and the mirror is in the other. Set the manual camera settings and don't forget about a constant source of light. It's very important to keep the camera still and lighting unchanged, otherwise you will mess up the trick. The next important thing is a script. You have to understand exactly when the main character does one thing or another, cause you'll need to film the scenes separately, one by one. First off, shoot your character's scenes. Do not cross the middle of the frame and watch that there are no unwanted shadows. Then film reflection scenes staying at approximately the same spot. Now let's open up Movavi Video Editor. Drop the first scene with the main character right on the timeline. Put the reflection scenes onto the additional video track above. Click on the clip properties, side by side, left. Now let's adjust the position of the clips so that the actions in them coincide. To make the reflection flicker, cut little pieces of the footage out of the clip on the additional video track. The second method, chroma keying. You'll need a pack of colored paper, green or blue. Make up a green or blue screen from these sheets of paper to cover up the entire mirror. Naturally, now it won't be reflected anyway. Film the character scenes first. Now you may need an assistant who will act as the main character's reflection. This way you'll get the footage in which your character's moves coincide with their reflection. Let's take our makeshift green screen out transform into the eagle tween and shoot some reflection scenes. Watch that the main character's silhouette doesn't cover up the mirror in the frame. Let's get back to Movavi Video Editor. Place the reflection footage on the main video track and drop the clips with your character on the additional video track. Let's go for tools, chroma key, and now let's select the color of our green screen and adjust the parameters for better result. You can add more stickers, frames or transitions to a video to maintain the horror movie style. I'm pretty sure you'll find something to a taste in the horror and horror circus effect packs from the Movavi Effect store. The broken lens filter from the built-in collection is perfect for our evil reflection. To apply a filter to a specific part of the scene, you have to separate the segment you need from the rest of your footage and drag the filter onto it. Let's also add the vertigo effect at the moment where my evil twin is casting a spell on me. Then you can adjust the filter intensity in clip properties and hide the splice behind the transition. Let's drag onto the timeline the black background picture to recreate the flickering light effect. 
reduce the opacity of the picture. Cut a little fragment from it, copy and paste the fragment several times at short intervals. Finally, apply the camera shake effect to both video tracks when the video reaches climactic end. To make the shaking in sync, the target clips must start at the same time. In our case, since the lower track clip has a transition, I choose to sync a cut on the upper track with the beginning of this transition. Let's spice up the scene with some color noise and low distortion filters. This will help us create the exact black magic effect we need. I also increase brightness and contrast of the reflection clip a little bit to add some glow. And the spooky Halloween video is done. Well, now you know how to scare your friends with a Halloween video. To make our own example, we use the Horror and Horror Circus effect packs from the Movavi Effects Store. But if you're more into cute treats and costumes, you may like the Halloween or Zombie Veggies packs better. All the links to the effect packs you'll find in the description of this video. Do you want to get more tips on how to use a green screen? Let us know in the comments what kind of chroma key magic you're dying to learn about. In case you like this video, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, subscribe and ring the notification bell to keep up with the channel's updates. Loser.